Hello everyone, it's Fernando Prieto, Developer Advocate at Huawei. Welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to include the new Bitrise Verify step to deploy in App Gallery Connect. I'm going to show you how easy it is to add this step into your workflow, how to configure the different step parameters, and also how to set up a Bitrise trigger. So whenever I create a tag on my repository, Bitrise is going to run this workflow to deploy in App Gallery Connect. Let's get stuck into it. Okay, let's head to the Bitrise workflow editor. I've selected one of my apps, which is the Disclosure app, it's just for this purpose. So for this example, what I've done is just removing the uh, unnecessary steps. Um, so we have the, the essential ones, so where we clone the our repository from GitHub. Um, I've got the one that installed the dependencies uh, necessary for the Android build. Um, also, we have some tasks configured for the greater runner. So in this case, we have, so I've got just the assemble release. So on the assemble release, um, it's gonna create the, the build, so the APK, and it's gonna be signed by the Android sign. So on the Android sign, we need to configure our signature. So it's able to sign it, and later, our important step right now is the app gallery deploy to app gallery connect uh, let's select the latest version so the latest version offers you the possibility of deploy your apk into app gallery connect completely so it's not going to be a draft anymore um, so if we take the parameters we need to change um, they will be the app ID, client ID, and the client secret. So those three are included into your App Gallery Connect profile of the app. So you can head to App Gallery Connect, check your app, um, get those credentials from there. Uh, so you link them here. In my case, I link them through, let me save this. Um, I link them through secrets. So you can add those three on the secrets. Um, so they are not gonna be exposed, exposed to anyone. Um, yeah, so that, that is the whole configuration. One extra step I'm gonna do in, in Bitrise is adding a trigger. So what I'm gonna create is this tag. It's already, I, I already created, um, and it's a tag that follows this pattern. So in my case, it's gonna be v3.0.4, which is the release I'm gonna create on GitHub. So anytime I create that release, this trigger is gonna launch the, the, the workflow for the deployment. So uh, you just need to add this, add the new trigger. Um, the tag uh, following the pattern that you need to follow um, that's, a, that's, that's it um, so let's go to github and let's add a new release so if we create a new version this is gonna be the v304 let me just correct uh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, we say uh, new. Uh, no, let's let's say version three oh four. So with this, everything will be working perfectly. If I publish the release. So we have a new release, we can see here. So this is the, the tag, but this is the exactly the, the name that Bitrise is gonna get. So if we come back, uh, I saved it previously the, the whole workflow, so it doesn't matter, I can leave now. So we can check now, um, you can see there is a, new deployment triggered so it's gonna take some time okay let's check um, Bitrise now so um, it's been submitted as a draft uh, now we're waiting for two minutes just for the whole submission 
So if we had to app gallery connect, we check that the app is still not submitted. Um, so we can see also the, the previous APK uploaded just for testing purpose. So one of the requirements is uploading your first APK here in the app profile. So you enable the option of using BitRise. If you don't do once, um, at least one uh, one time, um, you're not gonna be able to do through BitRise. So make sure you have at least upload one, one APK even though you don't need to release. As soon as this gets done, um, we're gonna go to App Gallery Connect. Uh, we're gonna check what we have. So now we have um, the result. So everything seemed to go perfectly well. Um, so we're gonna head to App Gallery Connect. And now we can see the there is a new version. Uh, it's not a draft anymore with the button submission anywhere. So is everything uh, is already in review, so we can cancel or we can uh, um, review, uh, add a reminder for that, but it's already submitted. Okay, this is it. Thank you for watching this video. Please stay tuned because in the upcoming months, the new versions of the App Gallery Connect step will be released with some more new features. Cheers.